There he is now, anyway. <laughs> He's great, isn't he? He is all right. Uh, does he have a name? No, I don't think so. Uh, the woman in the pet shop didn't mention one, anyway. No, <laughs> I don't know. How about Ted? That's a good name for a rabbit. No, I don't think that's a good idea, Dougal. You're forgetting I'm called Ted as well. <laughs> I could call you Father Ted. No. <laughs> Seriously, Dougal, you'll have to come up with something a bit more original. Hello, fathers. Hello, Hello Mrs. Mrs. Doyle. <laughs> How about Mrs. Doyle? <laughs> no, Mrs. Doyle is not a good name for a rabbit. You need something like Popsy or Bruce. All right. Wait, I've got one. You see the way he's got big floppy ears there flopping all over the place? Yeah. Well, why don't we call him Father Jack Hackett? <laughs> Perfect. Father Jack it is. What? Uh, nothing, Father. Dougal's named his new rabbit after you. What? Are you all right, Father Jack? What? Uh, he's not talking to you, Father. He's talking to the rabbit. What? I think Father Jack wants a drink. Drink! Drink! Maybe we could give him water. Water! Fick! <laughs> Dougal, this is getting far too confusing. Ah, Ted, I've got used to calling him Father Jack. Could we not call Father Jack something else? <laughs> Great. What do we call him, uh, Flipper? Flipper the priest. Yes! <laughs> no, Dougal, this is not going to work. Hello, Father Ted Crilly speaking. Crilly, it's me, Bishop Brennan. Oh, feck. Who is this? There is no Krilly ear. God, Dougal, I'm just left to sing feck to Bishop Brennan. Oh, he won't like that, Ted. Maybe it's all right, though. Uh, I put on a foreign voice so that he'll think you dialed the wrong number. <laughs> Krilly. Ah, hello, Bishop Brennan. <laughs> I think you got the wrong number when you called there. <laughs> Shut up, Krilly. Shut up. I'll make this quick. What would the following words suggest to you? Jack, sleepwalking, and bollock naked. <laughs> oh, no. Now, this is the third time in the last six months. You may have heard of Brian Noonan, hmm? A very important junior minister and a personal friend of mine. And I can tell you the last thing he and his family needs to see is the vision of an elderly priest wearing only a pair of socks and a hat. Now, I'll be around on Thursday to examine the security arrangements, and Krilly... Yes? If you ever try to bullshit me like that again, I will rip off your arms. <laughs> Bishop Brennan's coming over to have a word with you, Father, about your nude sleepwalking. Nudie Father Jack! <laughs> Can you think of any reason why you might be doing that? You're not having any uh, doubts about your vocation, are you? What? You can always share your problems with us. Father Dougal and I will always lend you a friendly ear. Isn't that right, Dougal? Absolutely. D do you want to talk about it now? Well, Ted, uh, Biker Grove. Oh, God, yes, after Biker Grove. <laughs> Go on there. Go on, boy. Fetch. Go on. Go on. Come on now, Dougal, get him into his cage. I don't want Bishop Brennan seeing him. Ah, Teddy might like him. No, he wouldn't like him. He doesn't like rabbits at all. Why not? It's a strange story. About ten years ago, he was in New York and he got trapped in a lift with about 20 rabbits for the whole night. They started nibbling his cape and everything. <laughs> How did they get in? I don't know. I suppose they must have burrowed in, you know, rabbits. <laughs> God, he can move fast enough, can't he? Why do you say that, Ted? Well, he just shot across the floor to me there. <laughs> Wait. That's your rabbit? Yeah. So where did this one come from? Uh, Ted, there's another one on Jack's head. <laughs> you make sure your rabbit doesn't get mixed up with these other lads. All right. Come on, Sampras. <laughs> what did you call him? Sampras, like Pete Sampras. <laughs> Why? Well, you know, rabbits, tennis, you know that whole connection there. <laughs> All right. Anyhow, we'll just release these spare ones into the wild, OK? Look at him there on his own without any other rabbits for company. Hmm? You must feel like Brian Keenan after they took John McCarthy away to another cell. <laughs> anyway, he'll get used to it. <laughs> Morning.
morning, Father. Bills, bills, more bills. Morning, Ted. Morning, Dougal. What will we do today? We'll have to get that rabbit of yours out of the way before Brishy Brennan comes over. <laughs> You'd go mad if you thought there's rabbit around the place. Right, fair enough. I hope he's in a good mood. Len can be very scary, you know, when... When... But, ah! <laughs> What's wrong, Ted? Rabbits! Rabbits, where? Oh, wow. <laughs> where the hell did these ones come from? God, it's like a big rabbit rock festival. <laughs> well, I suppose we just have to get used to it. Get used to it? We'll have to get them out of here before he arrives. I'll ring the pet shop. Uh, no. Uh, Ted, it was a travelling pet shop. They won't be back till spring. <laughs> God. What are we going to do? Well, wait, now, 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 there is actually something we can do, Ted. If we, uh, now, let me see now. Just wait a second there. Uh, um, I know, I know. I've got it, Ted. What? Right, now, now, the way I see it is uh, if we, yeah. Uh, yeah, now, wait a second. Yeah. Um, what, what's the problem again? The rabbits! Rabbits, yes. Yes, Ted, yes, yes. Sorry about that. I know exactly what to do. Why don't we give them to Father Larry Duff? You're right. He's always gone on about how we'd love to have a few rabbits running around the place. <laughs> I used to think it was just a mad thing to say. Hello, Larry. Ah, hello, Ted. How is it hanging? Um, it's, it's hanging fine, Larry. Uh, listen, I have a bit of a problem here. Uh, you remember you were looking for a few rabbits around the place? Oh, I do, Ted. That's one of my all-time fantasies. I'd love to have a few hundred rabbits running all over the place. <laughs> well, today's your lucky day. We've got loads of the things. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, Ted. I won't be able to take them. Why not, Larry? I sort of gave up on the rabbits idea. Well, it just seemed too far-fetched. So I got 12 Rottweilers instead. <laughs> <laughs> Take the rabbits, only I'd be afraid the Rottweilers might uh, upset them, you know. Yes, Larry, I, I understand. Bye. Ah, bye, Ted. <laughs> oh, you're a bad dog. Don't you look at me like that? You're a very bad dog. <laughs> he can't take the rabbits. He's got 12 Rottweilers. Hey, 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 you! Yes, Father? <laughs> Rats! But... <laughs> yes, Father, we can see them as well. Hairy Japanese bastards! <laughs> 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 <laughs>